Hi, welcome back to the channel. It's Ian from Penny Glen Cabin Life. It's nice and early this morning. It's 5am, well, two minutes past five. So I've uh, been up a few hours and that. So I've uh, got myself organised with the pups and everything this morning. So I've just put the kettle on the stove. So, but I'm going to have to change the gas bottle in the log store around the back because I've got a couple of gas bottles out there because it's starting, the flame's starting to go really low so it's going to conk out at any time really, that gas bottle but the gas bottle that that stove's been on has been on for two years and I've, uh, at some point I've been doing a lot of cooking on it so I'm really happy with that I've also got a big pan at the back that I'm going to put on in a minute for hot water to wash up uh, also, also, I've had some parcels, right? I've had a parcel of my brother-in-law, Anthony. He bought me this small, you've seen it in a second-hand shop, a small casserole dish. Now, do people remember this? Now, I would say in the 80s, nine, early 90s, Shell petrol station used to do vouchers. If you spent, I think it was £6, you got a voucher and when you got a lot of vouchers you could hand them over and get things and one of them they did a range in this pottery i can remember this from when i was little and this is one of the, the casserole dishes they did so it's just the right size for one person for the oven that's lovely that isn't it so thanks Ant. and also I already have on the back row two, four, six. I've got six of these already, and he's got me a, another little soup bowl as well, which goes with the collection. Ah. So I've got six of them already. So I'm trying to build these up, and I want to try and get all the other stuff in time. So if anybody's got any more in the cupboard of this set that they're willing to part with, bear me in mind because I'm trying to build it all up. Uh, so that's perfect, so thanks for that. And another parcel I've got is off my brother Stuart. He sent me this. Now look at that. See if I can get that to zoom in properly. No, I can't get the right in. It doesn't look clear on my end. See what happens if I do that. There, just turn the light off a little bit. It's a bottle, butter churner. So what you do is to make it, you put your stuff in and then oh, you turn it to make your butter. So we're going to have a go with that. We'll have a go with that in the next few weeks. That's brilliant. That's very old fashioned, isn't it? So say you unwind it. Come on. It's that. And then that's your bottle. Fantastic that, isn't it? Now, according to ask Stuart, he bought it in the 80s from a second-hand shop for a tenner. Bargain that, isn't it? I don't want to go on this lid now, does it? Here we go. So thank you so much for sending me that, Stuart. That's very, very kind of you. And uh, like I said, we will be using that on the channel. So I'm quite looking forward to making my own butter, that'd be good that. So that's that. Now, it's time for a coffee, so it is time for... Product placement. Get light back on. It's a bit bright that, so let's turn the lighting down just a little bit. There. Like that, that's better, isn't it? Eh? Lift that up slightly. That's it, right. Product placement, are you ready? There, that's one of my mugs I'll be selling with the cabin on. There. It's good that, isn't it? So we'll have a coffee with it, so we'll get some milk. Also, my sister says she's on about coming up to see me as well. My sister came up a while ago, so she's on about coming up again. That'd be good. 
quite looking forward to that. I look forward to seeing my sister. She's nice. Ah, uh, Sarah, my twin. So I'm uh, looking forward to seeing her. And she's going to be doing some jobs for me while she's here as well. Uh, what else has been happening? Uh, I'm going to show you the pups. The pups today will be nearly three days old, two and a half days old. So I'll show you the puppies. They're all doing fine. This little mermaids every so often like they do, like, you know. So they're all doing well. They're putting weight on. Brooke's looking after them fine. She's fine. I was finding yesterday it was red hot weather. Absolutely burning yesterday. So I had to put the fan on for them. So I've left the fan down there now, but it's not turned on. And if it gets hot again today, then I could put the fan on. So it kept her brook cool and it kept the pups cool. So it's perfect, really, for the sake of putting a fan on. Uh, what else? Uh, I've been recently starting a journal. So I've been doing a daily journal. So I've got the book, which is over there, and I've been filling it in. That way it's kind of a record of my life here. So one day when I'm not here, there'll be the videos on YouTube that I would left as a legacy in a way about my life in the cabin and also there'll be a journal as well so it means a lot to me that so that's about that so that's it for for today and uh the kettle's on oh kettle as well so i'm just taking off store Our Stuart sent me a new kettle he's look he's good to me Our Stuart. look at that it's a lovely kettle that isn't it because the other one we're fun to me it's a whistle strong really loud strong whistle on it so that's it. So thank you for that, Stuart. And he's also sent that pan that's at the back. And he's also sent me a great big pan for my stove for hot water. If I can get that pan on. That's a big catering pan, like that. So there's that one and then that one. And then I've also got a few big pans he gave me as well, which are up here on top. Don't know if you can see them on the camera. See if I can bring them over. Uh, some some big pans here. It's given me a couple of them. So I've sorted a lot of my pans out because I know everyone were, were writing comments to me on Facebook and things like that saying, God, you've got a lot of pans. But I have still got all my frying pans and I've got a lot of pans that I've got off of uh, Eileen's when she passed away when we went to sort of house so I've got a couple of really quality cooking pans and I've got a lot of frying pans I've got a lot of tea fowl pans I like the tea fowl pans and on stick so I've got them uh, and then I've got spares for stuff so that's about that uh, I'm going to put the radio on soon I'm going might listen to a few records and I'll show you the puppies do you want to see the pups? Come on, let's have a look at these pups. Come on. I'll just get this on. Right. I'm going to switch cameras so you can be able to see the pups better. Are you ready? Three, two, one. See? Switch cameras. I'm back. Right, let's go in here now. Right, I'm going to turn the camera around. Hold on a sec. Let me just turn it around. There we are. We're back. And there's our brookie. Looking after the puppies. There we go.
Uh, I've just got back up from the whelping box. I hope you enjoyed watching the video of the puppies. Um, I thoroughly enjoyed getting back in, in back into the video in again. Give me a new boost of life, really, in a way. And um, that's it for today. And can you hear me, kettle? Show you them that kettle. Told you it were a good kettle, didn't I? But it's a long time since some of you uh, heard a kettle off a stove whistling like that. Uh, so I'm going to make myself a coffee now in again my product placement mug. Uh, and I'm going to enjoy a nice little sit down and a coffee before I've got to start doing the dogs. And I'll see you again tomorrow. Thank you for tuning in. And stay safe, stay well. Okay. I'll see you tomorrow.